Pat Jeffrey, and I have an interesting makeup challenge. I thought of this while I was at work, and I was thinking to call it the Too Faced Makeup Challenge. So what you'll do is you'll split your face in half. You'll do one side, whatever you're most like, like either your dark or your light, and then your other half, the opposite. So you can do anything you want. You can do mysticals. So. What I'm going to do is my Too Faced. What I happen to feel most 50-50 is basically what it is. So uh, some days I'll be the most emo person that I am, or some days I'll be the most kawaii. So I'm going to do a goth versus kawaii. So this is going to be interesting. I'm really excited to see how this looks and how it's going to be. I just came up with this challenge. Don't know what I'm going to do, so I'm going to find out and see. So I'm really excited. So I've already primed my face. All I have to do is put my foundation on. And so my best friend just gave me this one. And uh, it's actually pretty good now. For my skin complexion because I used to be a beige now I've lined my face up quite a bit so I'm just gonna use my foundation all over my face and that's what you can use and you can use your beauty blender I just bought my new one today so I'm really excited but yeah so we're gonna do this Yeah, I took all my makeup off that I was wearing today so I can do this. And I'm really excited about it because if you ever are into the DC comics, they have a character called Two-Face. And this is where I came up with the challenge. And so I was like, hey, why not do a makeup challenge on your two personalities. So like mine's, like I said earlier, is goth and kawaii. So this is going to be interesting to do. And uh, also I have some news after uh, today, well after this challenge that I'm going to talk to you about that has to do with my channel and I'm going to leave that for the ending now I should have put stupid cold sore I hate cold sores alright I think I got enough on here <laughs> that made me look pale and horribly sick like okay so I'm going to try and get this back hold on no. that's going to take. Dang it. When you don't know how much you're going to use and you use... Oh my goodness. It's horrible. I can never figure out how much I'm going to use of the foundation, so... Well, that sucks. Alright, so I'm going to go in now with... Oh, good gracious. My HD powder to set it. That's because this is what I use to set my foundation. And I'm just going to go all over town with it. So let's see. And so I'm really excited about this. I love this. And I've been seeing a whole bunch of different challenges. And I like copying somebody's like uh, try to follow somebody tutorial. And so I was like... How about we just do a Too Faced challenge, which I gotta, I gotta fix my eyebrows so I know what I'm doing. Alright, now it's time to split the face. So, I'm going to, let's see, look at my mirror over here. So let's see, I think I'm going to do my left side, my emo, and then my kawaii. So, let's get started, shall we? Okay. 
clean off some of my brushes. Alright. So I'm going to go in with the My Little Pony palette. And I'm going to do my pink Y face that I always do. Just bring that. Alright, so I'm using this shade right here. And we're going to just do the outside. Just going to get it as pastel as I can. Do the other. Oh, I was about to do the other eye. <laughs> Alright. So we're going to do that. And then, let's see, go with my flat brush. All my makeup's up here. Why am I forgetting that? You know what? I gotta move this over here. Okay. So, oh no, where is it? Where's my other palette? Okay, there's my other palette. So I'm gonna take my Imori palette. Oh, and I'm gonna go, you can see which ones I have totally done is these two. So... I don't have setting spray, so I'm going to do the old-fashioned way. And I'm going to get this to go right there on my lid. Right. I wonder if that's too bright for y'all. Let me see if I can... I don't even look like I have anything. Okay, let's... Woohoo! Yep. Alright, let's see if I can do that. Okay. Alright. So that looks actually pretty good. Alright, I'm going to go back in with that other pink from my My Little Pony palette. I'm going to just shade that a little bit. I'm going to use a different color, actually. A little bit there. Let's see if we can. That's so not gonna work. <laughs> My lighting. Oh, there we go. We can go there. You can see how. So, this is so pastel, it's crazy. And so. Alright, I'm gonna go back. And I'm gonna do it there. See how pastel it is. It's so crazy. Alright, so I'm gonna go in with my little blurt crease. I'm gonna actually clean that off because I was I had blue this I wore blue this morning, so okay, dry that off. Alright, and I'm gonna go in with my orange from the Milo palette. And I'm just gonna Crease that into there so it kind of looks like a lovely little sunset, maybe. Alright. Alright. And then I'm going to go back with my palette and I'm just going to get that a little bit. Go in the corner of my eye. So, yeah. So, that's what it looks like right now. Alrighty, so I'm just going to, what am I going to use on the bottom of my lash? I think I'm going to use, what color do I want to use? I'm going to use a pink, another shade of pink. It's a more brighter beige, where is it? It's going to be this one right here. I think, yeah, this one right here. It's a little bit darker and shimmery, so I'm going to use that on the bottom right here. So we're going to go in there, make sure it meets with the end over here. Yeah. 
Alright. And of course, I'm going to go in with my blush. Oh, where's my blush? My blush is over here. So, my makeup, comp my makeup <laughs> huh, table is also my computer table, so... I'm just going to brush this up here. It's my foundation from Wet n Wild. It's the Ombre blush. So, yeah. You know what? I'm going to take that up into my... My, um... Uh, up here. Let me see. If, mm, I'm going to try and get that away. So bright in here. So yeah. Alright, I don't know if you can tell, but I just turned my overlight on to see if we can get this a little bit better. All I got is my lamp light, and it's extremely bright. Alrighty, so now we're going to go in with a highlighter. One of these days. Ugh. It's my Elf highlighter. It's the baked highlighter. And I love this stuff. So I'm going to go with my angle brush. And I'm just going to do this. And I'm just going to bring it right there. I need some better lights. And take that up into my template as well. Part of my nose. I'll just do my nose with this. And my Cupid's bow. Let me see. Ooh. Nope. Okay. I'm just trying to figure out lighting here. One of these days I'll have good lighting. Alright. So I got my highlighter on. Woohoo, that's some highlighting. Alright. So, let's do the eyeliner. So I think with the eyeliner, I'm just going to do a wingtip, a very thin wingtip. So we're going to go to see. So we got a very thin wingtip with this beautiful, and so I'm going to go, and of course most of my products are e.l.f. when it comes to mascara, eyeliner, and all that shazam. And so we're just going to use the e.l.f. mascara. I would like to branch out from my e.l.f. because I'm so against animal cruelty and when it comes to makeup it's really hard to ah, okay, okay. I'm not using my mirror I'm using my phone actually which is recording this and it's quite hilarious and no I don't have falsies the ones I want to get are very expensive and I'm a pull thing which oh my goodness so yeah, so now we're going to go for the lips, and I'm thinking of doing my natural, my, uh, this is Wet n Wild, um, Rose Quartz, so we're going to do half this side, and half that side, okay. So hard to do your lips half and half. Alright. Oh, this is bothering me. Alright. So we got this beautiful side. I know my lights are so bright, but... So we got that. We got the beautiful... You can see barely the orange right there. Now you can see every flaw in my face. Okay. Alright, so now for the dark mysterious side. My gothic. 
Alright, so we're going to put away my pastels. And we're going to go full fledged into the emo dark side. Alrighty. So, we've done our basics. We've done all that nice stuff. Move my camera a little bit. Alright. Get. Alrighty. So, let's see. What colors do we have that we can do on the side? You know what? I'm thinking I have not used Interstellar's dark colors. Well, that's because they're similar to the Pirates of the Caribbean. So I'm not going to use this palette. I'm just going to full on blown... Ow! <laughs> uh, Pirates of the Caribbean. I'm just going to go full on Pirates of the Caribbean on my left side. Alright. So. Let's go in. Uh, I don't need that brush. I need that brush. Uh. Alright. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna go on full dark side here. Alright. Alright, let's see. Okay, that's still a little bit wet. Alright. Woohoo! That is some pigment right there. That is extremely. Alright. Whew! That is pigment. Oh my goodness. Alright, we're gonna blend that over to this side to make it that gray look. Oh my goodness. Alright, that's... That is so crazy. Alright. Look like I got a giant black eye. <laughs> but we're gonna fix it. We are so going to fix this. Alright. Let's see what else. Alright, so... I'm gonna go with my flat brush. And... You know what I want to do? Okay. I want to go in with my green. I have this pretty green. It's called Sea Haze. It's this one right here. Right here. And it's beautifully green. So I'm going to take as much pigment as I can on it. And we're just going to go like that. Oh my goodness, I feel like I'm doing a Kelly and Dre. Oh my goodness, I am! <laughs> I did not mean for this to happen, oh my gosh. I, I love them. I Like, every day I see Kelly and Dre, which... She, Dre wears green, she has green hair, Kelly's pink with pink hair, she's... It's, oh my goodness, I did not mean for this to happen, oh my goodness. This is hilarious, so... Just my change my tone. <laughs> Alright. So yeah, we... Yeah, it's green! I think I need more pigment. Alright. Alrighty. I think I'm gonna go back in with the black. And I'm just gonna... See, that brush is my blending brush. And usually I use a different brush. Yeah, we're gonna go with this one. So much pigment on this. This is crazy. Alright. Alright. Alright, that's crazy. That's actually not too bad. I like that. Holy cow, this, I might wear that, actually. <laughs> That's good. Alright, I'm back. My mom's leave, about to get ready to leave and to go sing. So I'm stuck. <sighs> I'm just kidding. I'm not. Alrighty, so. I think we got that good enough. I kind of want to add. Ooh, I got an idea. To add some silver. Which I have, which is called Silver Mist. Which I swear they stole that. <laughs> I'm just kidding now. Now I had a 
uh, whenever I do my gaming systems, when I was in my teenage years, my nickname for my game characters would be Silver Mist. And that's what I would go by. Or a Rosetta Mist. Oh, this is so cool. I'm going to go on tour with black as well. And bring that silver up to my crease. Just like that. Oh, that is so cool. Alright, I'm going to go back in with my black. Which I got plenty on my brush. I'm just going to do that. Just fix that in. Oh my goodness, that is so cool! This is so cool. I, 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 I love this. Alright, so I'm going to do something a little crazy with contouring. Where's my contour? Is this my contour? Yes, it's my contour palette. Alright, I'm going to go in and I'm going to contour the heck out of my face. Alright. I have to use dark, and if I use black, that'd be like so weird. Contouring, that's all I do is contour. Alright. Alrighty. I think we contoured the heck out of my eyes. Contoured my nose. I am loving this. I am so freaking. And of course, I'm going to go in with my white. Oh boy. Alright, so. So, I'm using just white powder to whiten my face up where I contoured. So, you can get a picture and go with that. Just gonna whiten my whole face a little bit. So I look pale on one side, really pale. <laughs> and of course, this is gonna probably take most of my powder. And I'm gonna try and figure out. That's good. I think I'm going to go with a black contour. Ooh. Ooh, I like black contouring. Especially with this color. Oh, that looks cool. You know, you make the funniest faces that when you're contouring. Make this area darker. Alright. And I'm going to go back. Fix that area. Alright. Practically contoured everything in my face. Alright, so now I just might as well finish the green process. I'm going to go in. And I am going to do green on that. That is like the worst I've ever done. Eh. 
See, my contacts keep going in and out, like my vision does. And so it's a little hard to see where I'm putting my lipstick. Alright, okay. Eh. Mm, where's this? Okay, I'm gonna try and not fix my lip. Okay. Let's go back and reapply this side. So with that green eyeshadow that I showed you, I'm going to go in and I'm going to mat it with my flat brush. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I am losing my brushes. <laughs> oh my goodness. What? No, that's not it. I swear I just had my flat brush. Well, I guess I'll go in with my finger. I can use one of my other brushes. How about the... There it is. It was hiding from me. So, no, actually, I'm going to use my other dark. I'm going to use Menace. Oh, uh, okay. As a matting. Okay. It looks black, but it's a dark green. And then you can clean that up. Alright. So, I think I'm going to go for the green highlight. Okay, that's better, actually. Okay, so... My camera just died. On my phone. So, well, actually, my phone just died. So now you can see a better resemblance. Alright. So I matted my lipstick and so you got the pink side of me, my kawaii, and then you got a very dark side. So I had an idea that I was gonna go in and I'm going to see if I can, I'm gonna do this. Where's my mirror? Alright. So this is going to be interesting, actually, because <laughs> I've never done this. So I'm going to take my brush right here. It's very small, and I'm just going to color my eyebrow with it. I'm just going on a whim with this, and we're going to... There goes my lipstick. Mm. And we're just gonna color my eyebrow. <laughs> We've never done this before. Oh my goodness. So hopefully it will turn out. Alright. Alright. So where's. Okay, so I'm gonna need that. Ah! Wires, things. So yeah, so this is a uh, kind of interesting. So I'm using the uh, so I guess I feel like I said I'm just gonna finish up this Dragon Kelly thing that I'm doing. So, I don't know. Like, that looks pretty bad. But it's actually not too bad, I can tell you that. It, it's, I'm a little shook. 
at how good this actually looks. But also, my highlighting skills are not that great. You can see. You know what? I'm going to go in with my concealer. Just a moment. So I'm going to go in and I'm just going to apply some concealer to just shape and this up a little bit. Just make it a little bit better. I'm just going to use my finger and then I'm going to go over it with some white powder and put that over there. Just make it look like I was pale earlier. Alright, there we go, uh, it's looking so much better. Alright, so I'm going to go back in and I'm just going to bring that black back up. There we go, alrighty, alrighty. So, I got my kawaii side, I don't even know what I said, and then my other side. So yeah, I hope you all enjoyed. I had fun doing this. Um, and so, yeah, so I'm thinking about making another video on what I'm going to be doing with my channel, and a lot of other things, but... That's going to be in another video for y'all. But I hope you enjoyed. I hope somebody, please, somebody, make this challenge go worldwide, viral, go crazy. Because I had fun doing this. I had fun creating my two sides, which is kawaii and goth. And yeah, so come on, join in. It's fun. I challenge everyone. How about that? I challenge everybody to make a two-faced video of themselves and who they are. Because, you know, some people are a little bit of 50-50. You can be like a little, hmm. Or you can be like this little, no, go away, go away. But, yeah. But, yeah, I hope everybody has fun with this challenge. I love doing this challenge. It's fun. And... I love this. This was so fun. I hope everybody does it. I challenge my best friend, Kara Lee, to do this challenge. Hmm. Alright. I love y'all. Pieces, deuces, whatever.